Good afternoon, Holy Ghost. Good afternoon, Holy Good afternoon, Ghost. Holy Ghost. I worship you. I worship you. I worship you. I worship you. I adore you. I adore you. I adore you. I love you so much. I love you so much. I love you so much. I surrender to you. I surrender to I you. I surrender to you. Take over me. Take over me. Take over me. Lead me. Lead me. Lead me. Guide me. Guide me. Guide me. Protect me. Protect me. Protect me. Bring my blessings today. Bring my blessings today. Bring my blessings today. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The Bible says that where two or three comes together in my name, Jesus said that there I am in their midst. And also this afternoon, Jesus Christ is here. The Holy Ghost is here. God Almighty is here. Angels are here. We are in the presence of God and we'll have a privilege to go through the Word of God together this afternoon. Amen. Uh, we are in this special service where we are believing for the jobs of our choices, salaries of our choice, and the place of our choice, and we are saying that we're not going to die before our time. Amen. Amen. Then this afternoon we want to share the word of God about God's protection. God protection. He, he, God needs to protect what we have. God needs to protect everything that we own. And we must depend upon God for God's protection. Let us go through the word of God from the book of Psalm, chapter 5, verse number 11. The Bible says that, Let all who take refuge in you be glad. Let, let them ever sing for joy. Spread your protection over them. That uh, those who love your name may rejoice in you. The Bible says that, first of all, let all those who rejoice in you be glad. Let them be glad. You know, let them be glad when the Lord is taking care of them. Let them be glad when the Lord is blessing them. That's the only time where they can be glad. They can be glad when all is well. Then what the word of God is trying to say, let all be well. And when everything is well, and when everything is going well, then we can be glad. No one can ever be glad when things are not going well. But people can be happy, can be glad when all is going well. Then here, the summit is saying that, but let those who trust in you, O oh God, be glad. Be glad. Be glad when God is providing all the desires of your need. Be glad when you've got the job of your choice. Be glad when you've got the salary of your choice. Be glad when all is well. And may the Lord fulfill that in our life in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And the Bible says that, let them ever sing for joy. You know, like, the Bible is saying that, let them ever sing for joy. Let them ever sing for joy. Let them be glad in such a way that you can even sing unto God. Not just singing, but singing. Singing for joy. Singing of celebration. When God has done something wonderful and something great in your life, in such a way that you will be able to sing for joy. To be able to sing because you are joyful. Having to sing because you are celebrating His greatness. You are celebrating His goodness. 
let them ever sing for joy the bible says God will fulfill that in our days and in our life in Jesus name Amen. where all will be well when all will be well and you will get the job of your choice and you will sing for the sing for joy you will celebrate when you have got that job of your choice you will celebrate when you've got the salary of your choice at the Amen. place of your choice. And when we are not dying before our time in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And the Bible says that spread protection over them. In order for us to be able to see, to be glad. In order for us to sing for joy. The Bible says that it will be after when God have also spread protection over our lives, over our jobs, over our families, over our everything, so that you can be what? You can indeed be glad. You can indeed sing for joy because you are what? You are protected. Amen. Then this afternoon, after this special service, God is spreading his protection over you. God is spreading Amen. his protection over your job. God is spreading Amen. over his protection over our everything. Amen. Amen. So that you can really be glad. Amen. So that Amen. we can really sing for joy. Amen. In Amen. the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. And the Bible says that, that those who love your name may rejoice in you. Amen. Child of God, the Lord is spreading, spreading his protection over you, over Amen. us, because we love the Lord. And so that Amen. we may be able to rejoice in the Lord. Amen. Amen. So that it can be easy for you to pray. So that it can be easy for you to walk with God. So that it can be easy for you to do the things of God. Because all is well. Amen. Because Amen. all is well. Amen. Because he's, Amen. he's causing the good things to be happening in our lives. Amen. Amen. And the Bible says that in the book of Deuteronomy 23 verse number 14. For the Lord your God moves about in your camp to protect you and to deliver your enemies to you. Your camp must be holy so that he will not see among you anything indecent and turn away from you. The Bible says Amen. that the Lord your, our God is moving around our camp. It's moving around Amen. our camp. It's moving around our life. It's moving around our family. The Lord our God is moving. Amen. And the Bible says that He is not move, just moving. He's moving to protect us. He's moving Amen. to protect you. He's moving to protect Amen. your job. He's moving to protect your Amen. blessings. I don't know whether you are Amen. hearing what I'm saying. Amen. Amen. What God has given us, it is important for them to be protected. Then the Lord, when His presence is with us in our midst, in our houses, in our job, one of the things that that present of God, that glory of the Lord is going to do is to protect. Amen. So that we may lo not lose what we have. Amen. Amen. And the Bible says that the Lord Amen. is moving hey, in our camps to protect and to deliver our enemies to us. Amen. 
Amen. I want to ask this afternoon. I don't know what is your problem. I don't know what is your challenge. I don't know what is troubling you this afternoon, but the Lord is delivering you out of that trouble in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. The Lord is, is in our midst, in our life, in our careers, in our job. He is delivering you. He is taking you out and is destroying what you call an enemy. He is delivering what Amen. you call a problem. Is delivering what we call a challenge away from us in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. In the same way where the Bible says that in your came to protect you eh, and to deliver your enemies to you, he's delivering also your job to you. Your job to you. Salary to you. Your blessings to you. The Lord is delivering to you them to you. There's two, two kinds of deliverance. Another deliverance is being delivered from and delivered to. Delivered from whatever is the problem, the Lord is delivering us in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. What you are looking for, the Lord is delivering for us to us in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And the Bible says that Hey, your, your camp must be holy. Amen. Our camp must be holy. Amen. We must make sure that we are living, we are doing things as per the word of God. Amen. So that when the Lord has come to protect us, he may be not, there must be nothing that offend him. That's what the Bible is saying. Amen. Then he must not see anything in distance and turn away from you when you're doing that. When you have make sure that you are living a holy life. Amen. When you are making sure that there is no any sin that the Lord will see and he will move away. Amen. Child of God, the Bible is saying that we must live in accordance to God's word. So that God may be able to bless you. So that God may be able to protect you. Amen. So that God may be able to fight for you. Amen. The word of God Amen. is saying that we must live a holy life. Amen. The word Amen. of God is saying that we must run away from sin. Amen. So that Amen. there must be nothing that hinders the Lord. Amen. I don't know whether you are hearing what I'm saying. Amen. So that yeah. there must nothing that does what? That hinders the Lord. That will make it impossible the Lord to give you the job of your choice. Amen. Salaries of your choice. Amen. At the place of Amen. your choice. Amen. The Bible says Amen. that, yes, what you ought to do. Hey, your camp must be holy. Amen. Don't keep anything that the Lord doesn't love in your life. Amen. Don't keep anything Amen. that the Lord does not love in your career. Amen. Don't keep anything that the Lord doesn't love Amen. in every sector of our life. Amen. We must keep and do things Amen. that the Lord loves. Amen. So that he may be Amen. able to be blessed, keep on blessing you. Amen. To protect us and to defend us in Amen. Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And the Bible says in the book of Joshua chapter 24 verse number 17. It was we, it was the Lord your God who brought us and our parents out of Egypt. From that land of slavery and performed those great signs before our eyes. He protected us on your in our entire journey and among all nations through which we traveled. Then the Bible is saying that first of all it was God Himself who have taken us out of poverty who have taken out of problems, who have taken us out of challenges. 
and he did many things to be where you are now Amen. and did many things to and is still doing many things to where you are going Amen. Amen. and the Bible said that he protected us from the entire journey among the nation which we travel through which you travel the Bible is saying that it was God who protected them it is God also who is protecting us Amen. let me tell you this sometimes when we are seeing God's hand blessing God's hand protecting us God's hand doing wonderful things in our life it's just because it's God's hands it's not because the devil is powerless Amen. no no it's not that the devil is powerless it's just because God is on our side Amen. as the Bible says that Amen. if God be for us who can be against us Amen. Then that means we are shining and things are well because God is by our side. Amen. And that is something that we must remember. Amen. That I did not just get the job that we have received by chance. Amen. We did not just get the jobs that we have, the blessing that we have by accident. Amen. But it is God who has been by our side, blessing us. Amen. It is God Amen. who has been by our side, protecting us. Amen. Then it's very, very Amen. much important for us to remain in the presence of God, loving God, so that God may continue to protect our jobs, so that God can continue to protect our blessings. Amen. Amen. So that God can continue to do good things in our lives. Amen. Because Amen. sometimes the problem is when people forget that it has been God who have been doing great things in our life. It is not by might, it is not by power. It is not because of our connection. If it is any connection, it is God who have blessed us with those connections. Amen. Amen. It's very, very much important. That's why what God has done in our life, what God has done in the life of others who lived before us, it was written down to remind us. Amen. Lest we forget. Amen. I don't know whether you are hearing what I'm saying. Amen. So that we may not forget that it is God who have preserved us, protected us, and provided, and who's continue to provide. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. In the book of Ezra, chapter 8, verse number 31, the Bible said that on the 20th, 12th day of the first month was set out from Ahava Canal to Jerusalem. To, Je, to go to Jerusalem. The hand of our God was on us and he protected us from our enemies and bandits along the way. I'm saying to you, I don't know which way which you are traveling today in your career. Which way are you tra traveling? What is the season of your life? What is the season of your, your things? But the Lord, as He protected them, He will protect us in Jesus' name. Amen. The Lord will protect us from all the attacks of the enemies in Jesus' name. Amen. No weapon fashioned against our us and our anything shall prosper in Jesus' name. Amen. Because the Bible said that Jesus Christ is still the same yesterday, today, and forever. Amen. As it's still the same, indeed, he will do what he did before and he will protect you. Amen. As God Amen. protected Daniel from the den of the lion, he will do it for your career in Jesus' name. Amen. He will do Amen. it for every sector of our life in Jesus' name. Amen. As Amen. Daniel in the morning also, he came out 
out of the den of lion and harm. Nothing of yours will be an harm even at the end of this year in Jesus' name. Amen. Because the Amen. great protector will protect our everything and you will be untouchable in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Let us Amen. go to the book of Psalm 32 verse number 7. The Bible says that you are my hiding place. You will protect me from trouble and surround me with songs of deliverance. Amen. David says that you are my hiding place. He says that you are my place of refuge. You are the one in whom when things are good and when the things are bad, I go to and I'm protected. Amen. I go to and I'm defended. So the Lord shall be, shall, shall be, must be for us in Jesus' name. Amen. Where in Him we must live. Where in Him we must move. Amen. Where in Him we must have our being in Jesus' name. Amen. And no weapon fashioned against us I will ever prosper in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I don't know whether you hear what I'm saying. Amen. We are ministering Amen. deliverance to your job and protection for our careers and our blessings in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. The Bible says that, you know, in the book of Psalm 91, verse number 14, because he loves me, says the Lord, I will rescue him and I will protect him because he acknowledges my name. The Lord is saying that us who are his children, because we love him, because we love him, the Bible said that God said that he will rescue us, he will protect us. Amen. I don't know where you are. I don't know what is happening in your company. Amen. I don't know what is going to happen in your country. But the Bible says that don't worry, child of God. The Bible, I'm not talking to you today, maybe. I'm talking to you next year. I'm talking to you. But the Bible says that don't worry. The Lord said that he will rescue us. The Lord is saying he will rescue you. The Lord is saying that he will protect us. He will protect your job. Amen. He will protect your car. Amen. He will protect your house. Amen. He will protect your blessing. Amen. Our everything Amen. is covered by the blood of Jesus in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And we are get continuing to pro that opportunity also is protected. Amen. You will not lose Amen. any opportunity. Amen. We will not lose any blessing. Amen. By fire, by force, in Jesus' name. Amen. Anywhere because it's a midday service, can you say, My day is blessed? My day is blessed. My family is blessed. My family is blessed. My career is blessed. My career is blessed. Our countries are blessed. Our countries are blessed. Everything is turning around for my good. Everything is turning around. I will not die before my time. I will not die before my time. I will never be sick in my life. I will I will never be sick in my life. I will never be broken in my life. I will never be broken in my life. Prosperity is mine. Prosperity is mine. Favor is mine. Say devil. Take off your hands. Take off your hands. From my everything. I lose angels now. Angels. Angels. Bring my harvest. Bring my harvest, my miracles, my miracles, my testimonies, my testimonies, my jobs, my jobs, my money, my money, my customers, my customers, angels, angels, represent me, represent me, present me, present me, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Send me the grace of our 
our Lord Jesus Christ. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. The love of God. The love of God. The fellowship of the Holy Spirit. The fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Be with us all. Be with us all. Surely goodness and love. Shall follow me. Shall follow me. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. And I dwell in the house of the Lord forever. And I dwell in the house of the Lord forever. I in the house of the Lord forever. Say, Lord Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ. You are my Lord. You are my Lord. You are my Savior. You are my Savior. Wash me with your blood. Wash me with your blood. Forgive me my sins. Forgive me my sins. Bless me today. Bless me today. Protect me from today. Protect me from today. From today, from today, I am born again. I am saved in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Honestly, to us this afternoon, may the Lord bless you. Have a blessed and a successful day in Jesus' name. Bye bye, everybody. Have a blessed morning, day, and afternoon, and night. Amen. Bye-bye. Amen. Bye. Bye.